Just grab each other. Oh my god. Cool guys. You oh, move down the tunnel. Over this guy. <laughs> Um, Ouch. You were walking down this tunnel, and it actually feels a little better to be in a place that uh, is sort of scaled down to your expectations. Oh, wow. The tunnel is long and straight, and eventually you can see <laughs> that it opens into a chamber. Whoa. Is it dusty? You see this first. You're the first one to notice. And actually, the rest of you notice, because it's almost like there's, there's almost a warm glow at the end of the tunnel. You're actually approaching light of some <gasps> sort. So I'm like, wow. I listen. Slowly, You slowly. begin to listen. Go ahead and make a perception check for me. Do, do, do. I want to perceive things as well. Uh, Perce uh, not great. Yeah, perceiving. I see light. I think we should go toward it. Uh, did you roll a one? I got a four. What'd you get? Well, I rolled Are a they one. trying to listen for things? They're nice. trying to listen for things. I, got I rolled a one, so I got eight. Terrible job. All right, I'm going to try and listen since well. I'm up front. Hey, come on, elf girl. <laughs> To you guys go. Listen, you know what? No. No, no, no. 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 After, after all that, nobody hears anything. Nobody knows anything. I want to hear. Nope. I want to hear. Nope. The yeah. silence Go ahead and roll your perception check, Lara. 19. <laughs> Plus my 10. 11. Wow. Plus my, uh, my. 11, 30. Ele 12, guys. I have 12. Plus my 12. Okay. So ahead of you, way ahead of you, you know That's that you're 31. definitely approaching a, a, a wider chamber. You can see the orange glow, and you can see that it's. It's, it's almost like over time it sort of moves a little bit. It's not quite like flickering of flames, but there's some unsteadiness about the light source. You don't oh, otherwise crap. see anything that jumps out at you. Guys, I don't think it's a good thing. What does it look what like? It looks like it's moving. What? Maybe like someone with a torch the or what? Maybe. Moving. There's definitely something over there. Is that a freaking fire elemental? I don't know. Can I it's scout? Not a, I don't think it's Can a Can I dragon. sneak up ahead? You can't stop me. Is that what I, I sure know is that That's what I was just about I to say. I can't stop think you. It's a good Alex thing. Alex moves ahead. What the fuck? That's a but th your foot calls are echoing. No big deal. And, and Lyra is, is still trying to say something, no. and you're shouting back. It's two or three in a row. You're making mm -hmm. a whole bunch of noise, and the whole thing is just, ah, oh my you, gosh, you know. Alex. But, but nothing happens. Like, you you just are approaching this light source, and you can see that, indeed, uh, oh, are you going to go all the way up to the, to, the, to the edge of the room, or? Yes. Okay. So you are, you thing. come up upon a large chamber that looks like it once held hundreds of people at a time. Um, oh no. At the head of the chamber, there is this massive statue of a oh, dragon shit. that it's looms a over a large stone table. Oh. On the table, on the stone table, there is a huge iron spike that's almost as long as tall, as Crag is tall. Aside from that, oh. You see that there are two doors in the room. Oh one on the leftmost wall, up by the, up by the dragon statue, and up by the right hand wall. He says oh, this chamber pretty. is pretty huge. So you, you would guess that this is almost like almost like a it feels like a, like a <coughs> gathering place for for tons of people. You see the light, the the orangey glow that's that's in this room actually comes from uh, uh, drifts of magma at the far end that sort of seep oh. out of the walls so that's why it's and form warm. a pool. And yeah, it's definitely warm down here, and it, it gives it casts off just enough light for you to see by. Uh, with the glasses on, uh, normally this would be dim light, but you can see as if it's normal light with the glasses. Do we hear chanting? <gasps> Ooh, that's no. not good. I don't like that. in there. I'm gonna, you hear nothing. I'm gonna turn around okay. and Quigley's go back to the group. Okay. You turn around I'm and really worried about okay. quickly. Okay, guys, mm -hmm. it's a huge chamber room and it looks like there's a statue of a dragon in the center. I don't know if it's a sacrifice or what it is. Then there's two doors on either side and the light is actually lava from their earth. Oh, that's why it's hot in here. Yep. Can we see, can I see now a little bit or no? If you want to go, yeah, I mean, like, you can see, no, the, I mean, you can see the approaching. Moving yeah. up, can, so, we, yeah, if you can guys I start up, to yeah. see, like, low light right where we're at? Yeah, if, if, again, it, it's, it's in, the, in that chamber. It is treated as, as dim light, so, yeah. Okay. Oh, oh. So, I don't. Did you see any There's no movement. No, no, nothing. But I'm, a, I don't know. I don't know if the statue will come alive or what, but it looks, <laughs> it's a dragon. Uh, can can dragons? How big is the dragon statue? It's it, it was pretty. It was huge. Oh right? yeah, it was a really big statue. It, it was, was humongous. Great, magnificent statue. It was a magnificent statue. <sighs> oh, I well. Do you guys want to come up and look? Forward. Let's go forward. Let's go forward. You know. <laughs> see on my face. I got this. Are we going? Do you get, let's let's just go forward. I'm oh, sorry. Here we go. Let's go. Let's go. You creep. 
forward. And eventually, yes, you come upon this chamber. Oh, this is scary. Um, I don't like that. Uh, statue. Yeah, that's Lyra, really cool. Make yeah. A knowledge religion check. Okay, let me just fix <laughs> that. Oh dear. Six plus. You never make those checks. How about me? Can I make another religion check? Six plus seven is thirteen. Thirteen? Yeah. I mean, this isn't a, a super tough thing to figure out, but to you, like, you get this immediate sense that you are in a place of worship, uh, but oh. it is not to any deity, deity meant to bring comfort, comfort or protection to its supplicants. Guys, I don't think this is so a good I, place. So I'm gonna, hey, crack. Do you see that giant That's spike in the middle? Yes, Guys, um, this don't know seems like some... a worship area. I think you were right. I think this might be like, did you say something about sacrifice? A sacrifice or yeah, worshiping? Because it's not, it's not a good sense, but this is definitely a place of some kind of worship. And there's lava. I just don't think Everybody we should stay here. Everybody make a perception check. No! Well, we don't okay, know what's fine. happening yet. That's not helping. Cool, I don't see anything. 15 six, plus my 11. I have 16 plus my 9. 2 plus 7. Alright. That's nine. 9. For those yeah, of you job. rolling <laughs> higher than just the worst numbers I've ever heard come out of the group. No, I rolled a good number. Thanks. Uh, you can almost, it's its like almost at the edge of your hearing, so faint that it's, you're not even sure if you're really hearing it. But it's almost like there's a low, soft chanting in there. Guys! Coming from some indistinguishable source, almost like it's all around you. Guys, we need to get out of here. We need to leave. I hear, um, like a- I'm gonna detect magic. You detect I a source of magic coming from ahead of you, where the the dragon statue like and the chanting. altar and the and I the hear it too, spike are laying. We need to get out of here. We always need to get out of the. Let's see what Marcus sees. You're chanting. Yes, I know. Sometimes this I'm crazy, but thing? I feel like no, no. What? It's not a female thing. I don't like how you. No, we are going to move into. We need to get out of There's this chamber. There's nothing in here. There is though. There's, There's something, something we can't see. And, um, Okay, see, see, it's not a woman I mean, thing unless you're saying you're also a woman. Uh, you, it's a, it's a moderate enchantment ahead of you, yeah. Yeah, could it be that just Jim would that not. Would my uh, dungeon not knowledge dungeoneering work down, down here or no? Yeah, what would you want to know? Um, by looking at the statue ahead, like, I don't know if there's anything that looks odd or different, or it just looks like a dragon. Check. Something. I mean, again, you're looking at it from pretty far away. If you want to get up to it and kind of inspect it, you can do that. I don't know if I want to. Don't do it. Don't. I, I don't have to. Any, if we get into a fight, guys. No. If we get into any Quickly, kind of fight, where I'm are you to go guys. forward? <laughs> I cannot help anyone if we get into a fight. You got your, you got your quick boots. That's true. Like, truly not a good idea. I think we need to get out of this room. Maybe, so are, we're standing at at the entry. To yeah, you guys are kind of standing looking. You just entered the room. You're looking around, seeing all this stuff. Can we, so can I take a look at yeah, go ahead. the entrance and see if there looks like there could be a door that could close? Oh, yeah, in? yeah, absolutely. Go ahead and make a perception check. So look cute. at this man thinking. We're thinking. Using his skills. We're absolutely thinking here. So, I'm not going to talk 18. to a dragon. Uh, you don't see it. It looks like the, the tunnel, this is just a, a tunnel out. cut, much like the other ones. It doesn't look like there's any crease where like something could come through or like portcullis holes or anything like that. It doesn't look like that would happen. Where was the spike? Where's the spike in it's this It's just thing? laying across this huge cave. I don't think right anyone should touch dragon. that spike. Just, yeah. This is a sacrifice. Just don't, we just need to, we need to get out of here. Like, human sacrifice? No. I That's probably, a really big spike. It's a dragon sacrifice. They're trying it to is. kill it. It is definitely oh, big. Yeah, it's, it's oh, big. Oh, that reminds Never mind. I'm not going to say spoiler alert in case I'm wanting to see that. Okay. The show. Okay, so. Anyone hearing me? What? I have no more spells, so if we get into that's, a fight. That's fine. Oh, really? So I've just taken a look at this this entryway here, and this isn't going to close if we go inside. I, I'm fairly certain if we go in here, we can still get out the same way. So you... This could be our way out. If we get... I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this. Now, what I'm going to say. The last time we were in a similar situation, a religious place, uh, and at the end of it, I detected magic, and there was an altar. And a mummy. I don't think that went no, well. It's... Yeah, I remember the mummy. We need to get out of here. You That's guys all need I'm to saying. listen. But there was cool stuff. Oh! I mean, you've got... Oh, boy, was there cool stuff. You're right, Craig. 
You got some new. Look at these robes. Craig, I want to live. Look at I these agree robes. With, I agree with Marcus Just right now. We've got to find Quigley also. Look we at those robes. Out of here. <laughs> look at all the things he gets from us. Look at all these things. You know what? We'll discuss what about it when we're out. We're going to discuss so Richard that. Sloan's comment right now. I think we all need to just take a moment and address Lyra objects to Marcus's everything. Yet yeah, more often than not, Marcus suggests the truly moral, good route for the party to take before they totally ignore him. Richard, thank you. Thank you for recognizing the truth that has been out there all along. I really appreciate it. I'll send you the 20 bucks later. There's a Marcus fan. There it is. Although. He didn't spell your name. Right. It might be autocorrect. Earlier they spelled your name Craig with a C. Yeah. That's, That's my brother. So, <laughs> now what, what I know, what I have the feeling, so we were we were going down this tunnel. Oh, I'm going to interrupt you for just a second. We are terrified. We are afraid. I like, am. Anybody at home, like, why don't they go forward? We're all legitimately I'm actually afraid. really not okay with this, and I keep saying yeah, we need really to turn scary. around. So we were going down this big tunnel. Huge tunnel. Straight. It was just basically just. It, it, it was sometimes it would wind in places or like curve a little bit, but, but generally in one general direction. direction definitely, okay. yes. So we went on an offshoot tunnel <sighs> yes. that was also straight. Yep. And now we're looking in this room and we see straight ahead the dragon, and then there's a door on the left and a door on the right. Yeah. In this room. There are depth. In the room. I, I, in the look, room. In, we're, room. in this room. There's we're in the room. room. You take a in the broom. Room. Yeah. In the room. And sweep the floor. An adventure We're potentially trapped forever. I'm not, that's, I'm not disagreeing that we have to get into this room and explore. The question is, is now the right time to do it, or do you guys no. want to rest up yes. and see if you feel better? I'm what? actually agreeing that with from Marcus the beginning. Here. I don't think it's smart to go I in that room. I am feeling good about things right now. That's because I but healed you, but I'm not okay. Can we take a vote, Craig, or do we have to listen to you? Ooh, I'm not trying to be that rude, but I think maybe we should just. We can go in that room. Always with the voting. Wait, just listen. What I, room? If we go into that... But I'm that. thinking this left door could possibly lead back out away. So you want to go to one of the doors? Not right away. I would like to go towards the altar just to get closer to see. Listen, I'm not saying I want to disturb. I'm not going to John Buco it and take a thing that someone Strike, put there and pick it up forth. and throw it like that's some a satanic technical. Yeah, 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 that's too technical. You're not going to pull a squire quickly. <laughs> that's what I said. Oh, okay, sorry. That's what yeah. I said. Okay, go up to the altar. Oh, you're gonna have me? Uh, yeah, sure. You just said you just volunteered yourself. You said oh, you're gonna do God. it. Going in. As he walks forward, I go. I go. Oh, I'm, I'm going not, stepping I'm, back. I'm actually I with now. My, yes. Now, to, this is a pretty large room. Again, we're talking like like a lot of people. Oh this hell. So when he, if he, you have. You tell me how far you want to go, but it could be, you know, 180 feet before you get to the oh, end of this. Oh, it's that This is a large big? place. Several hundred people could have gathered here at one time. That's fine. A, I, Alexander Beecroft mentioned to shoot the statue with a crossbow. No. So I am. Um, idea. I'm moving up. It's actually not a Okay. Idea. To the altar, but I'm keeping a safe distance. I'm staying at the it. door. I'm walking behind you. 30 feet away. 30 feet away. 30 feet away from the altar. That's how Don't where I want to go. I'm walking behind you. Okay. And I just want to get a closer look at this stuff because I would know exactly what these symbols were. If I saw anything on here, I, I would be the one to know. Oh, definitely. Because all, yeah, I have all the stats that know all the things. I'm gonna move halfway between so Crag and the door. Halfway between Crag and the door. Lyra, I'm at the door. You're by the door. Yeah. You're like Jim is like so ready to throw something at us like right now. I have no. I can't help them. Yeah, I mean that's obviously. I, you split I, up. I, 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 I messaged to Crag. I whispered to him. What do you see? What do you see? You see, uh, this does look, the, the first you notice the statue itself. It is the fearsome visage of a great dragon that looks out over the chamber. I see the Looming over this table. Great dragon. Um, it's a statue. You see the, the stone table itself. Uh, it is impressive, and you can see that there are deep channels that There's have been cut into the stone. stone um, I'm right next to you. <coughs> you notice There's that uh, across the table, there lays this huge spike. And it looks like there's a couple of objects on the table as well, but you can't from where because there's there's like a couple of steps up to it, so you can't see what the like you you can't see what the smaller things are, but you can definitely see the spike and you can definitely see the dragon. Oh my stop. goodness! Stop. Wait, I don't. There's a dragon and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that sounds like a good show. What, what kind of stuff is I it? I don't see any of this. I'm gonna go a little closer. On. 
A little closer. Go a little closer. Oh, my pucker no, there are, there are steps. Closer. There are steps. I am steps making there. diamonds. I'm not going. Right I'm now. going almost to like to the steps. Okay. I don't, I'm not going to step on anything. Okay. Mine's five Correct. feet behind you. Get a better right? view. But, but I mean, it doesn't give you a better view because again, you're the angle. I mean, you're looking basically up at this table, so it doesn't really give you a better angle of what's on it. I'm really tall. I understand climb this that you're a tall man. If if she got on my shoulders. Would we be able to see what's on the altar? Uh, what do you think? We have to climb up the stairs and look. Yeah, he thinks we're going to die. What, what, if, hands what if three of us climbed up on top <laughs> of his shoulders, Chip? If you put on a trench coat and convince the dragon that you're actually just one It is the man, dragon! <laughs> then I'll allow it. Hey, I can't... Psst. What? I can't see what's up there. Can you make I us think fly? I am going to go... I think I'm going to go up there and take a better look. That sounds like a Wait, 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 wait. Let me detect traps on the stairs. Okay. Does she have to touch the stairs to do that? No, I don't. What? But multiple, <laughs> there's multiple steps to stairs. You hey, can, you she can knows detect that. Them. You can just give don't a Don't be perception. so degrading. Perception check. Part of, part 15, of proceeding Marcus. for traps is, is being careful not 15 to 15 plus my 11. Look at 15 better. plus your 11. You are fairly certain that the stairs are solid. They have no traps. That you can. Hey, uh, so okay. here's here's Craig. what I'm thinking. Hey, Let's go up Craig. the stairs. Yeah. It is there is magic up there. So listen. He's not listening. Could this spike? Could this spike be holding? So, is this dragon the dragon? Oh. And it's turned to stone because there was some sort of spell, <gasps> and the spike is the somehow spike. on the altar, binding it or. Locking it in. Sure. Sure. Should I grab the spike? No. Oh my god. No. 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 So you're gonna move up to where he was. You guys are like leapfrogging. Yes. Right, you get up there. Now I'm moving back to where I'm moving up to where Craig is. All right. So you guys are both at the bottom and of the stage. I'm there I too. I want to detect I'm... magic and see if I can figure out what the focus point is of the magic. Okay. So or it if takes multiple. you. Uh, it, it, you you detect like uh, there are multiple sorts. It's hard for you because there are there are two a, a minute two maybe two to five distinct sources. So it's hard for you to pinpoint because you can't. Yeah, you don't even have you, you know that you don't even have line of sight on a couple of them. So it's yeah, it, it's you're getting a sense that there's these auras of magic, but you're not sure exactly. The spike, you can you can definitely pick out the spike because that's like you it's it kind of dominates the the field. But uh, there's other sources. Any magic on the stairs themselves? The stairs do not. Or the uh, as, yeah, so you've it been standing the there objects for, themselves that are magical. Uh, you, you've been you've been standing there, you focus in, you focus in, you focus in. You you definitely detect the spike and then there's something else magical that you don't see but yeah. but not the altar not the physical altar but items either on either the top of the altar or items on top yeah. of the altar yeah. okay what do you get i step back i go, okay. I, go I just go walking away back to yeah. my spot that Marcus. i was going and i'll whisper to him no 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 and i'll be like i'm like it's uh the spike is definitely magical and then there's other stuff up there that's also magical what about the doors doors magical doors are not magical Nope. So now you're standing by me. Yeah. Oh. I'm, hey. going, I'm going up there. So I ask him all of this. Don't touch anything. Just look at it. I'm Actually, I can hear him. Never you go mind. Up. I'm stepping up to look. Yeah, I can hear you. Yeah. Up onto the altar. So As what did you, you discover? Are getting closer to the altar, and you're looking out <clears throat> over these things. Oh my God. You're seeing. You can almost. No one listens to me. You can almost. I know. Like here. Even though you couldn't before, this this chanting, all which around. I mentioned, and it's growing a little bit louder, and a little bit louder, and all of you are starting to hear it, and Craig. everyone in the room, Craig, needs to make and then a will save. Ah, oh, son of a biscuit! Dang, I should have stayed out of the room. And mine's a leaner. Kumbaya. Kumbaya. Sure. Got twelve. Twelve plus eleven. Perfect. 12 plus 11, you are unaffected. Okay. 15. 15. Marcus, you, Lyra, 
you are standing back there and you're watching Craig get up to the altar and up to the altar and you can hear this chant. You would have heard it before and it's going louder and Guys. louder. And you're watching and all three of your friends oh, begin no. walking up the stairs towards the altar. And as Stop. Craig, you are the first one, you climb up onto the altar. No, you no, watch no. him as he lets his hands come out. He's stretched, he turns to face <laughs> what you. What are you doing? And several objects on the altar rise up, begin to surround Craig. You see uh, uh, a it. long Don't, no. dagger. No. You see a uh, many-headed scourge. I would not just be you standing here. You see a bone What's saw. A you see a pair of pronged pinchers, and they begin to descend upon Craig. Craig, no. you're just standing there. Sacrifice. You can see a crowd of people uh, chanting and waving their hands. A crowd of people? No, 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 no. You watch as these no, tools, no, and they're no, just cutting no, into Craig. No, and no. Blood begins no, to flow. No, sanctuary. Craig, I'm sanctuary him. Craig. You take 10 points of damage. The, oh. damage. the rest of you know, reach the top of the altar. Lyra, what do you do? You see your friends there about to climb up onto the altar. I don't want to try to stop Craig, them. what do you do? I go run up and I try to get them off of this. This Let's is ridiculous. Let's roll initiative to see how this is. Is it all out. of us against Lyra? Oh, oh my gosh, and I just rolled a seven. <laughs> plus my nine six. plus four, 13. 13, 13. for Alex. Oh, I don't have anything. Alex, I don't Lira have anything. Thirteen. You're both. You're on a thirteen. I don't have anything. Lira and Alex are both. Lira and Alex are on a thirteen. Craig. Oh my gosh. 19. Oh my gosh. Oh my 19. gosh. Marcus. This uh, chanting's really unsettling. Nineteen. Nineteen. Is the it's not soothing or calming. It's how how many of these chanters are there? You don't see anything. Is it do? Did right. you just say we did? Craig. No. It we... is the. I Top see. of the round, you get another will save. You 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 know, gosh, like gosh, there's almost gosh. like a part of you inside that knows that you can feel the agony as these tools cut into you and no. you're just being flayed this is alive. So disgusting. But you can't seem to control yours. You can't seem to get down because another part of you feels exalted. You feel like this is your purpose <gasps> is to to give your life for the glory oh, of something. Try to fight it off. Make a will save. Come on, man. Oh. Nope. <laughs> nope. 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 Just uh, regain control of your body. Four. Four. Two plus Marcus. two. Four. I'm... The tools begin to attack Marcus. You are Wait, going what? to take. Oh yes. They, it's my turn. Walking. I know I it's your safe? turn. Am I turn? After your first one, you get an attempt to shrug it off, but not on. But the your first turn isn't until the end. On your each each round, it doesn't, it won't oh, matter. I think I'm confused as to how much I suck at this. Because the, the the haunt itself doesn't, it doesn't matter. It's fine. It doesn't matter. What do you got? It doesn't matter, you take eight points of damage. Did I get an AC thing or anything? It, it, I roll against it and it doesn't matter. Uh, how many? Take eight, eight points of damage. Eight points of damage. And on Thank the you. next round, you'll get a will save. Uh, Alex. I'm not really sure how this works. You also. Come on, Alex. standing upon the altar. No. You are cut and flayed for eight points of damage. Lyra, it is your turn. You see your friends are just getting torn apart by these things that are just surrounding them, cutting into them. Okay. What yeah. do you do? Not I go up to them. Okay, you clearly, go up to the altar. Yes. They, yeah, you, you can see them. They're just, they don't even, they, none of them like look at you. They don't react to you. They, they seem to be totally out of their Can minds. Can I see anything around me other than those things that are cutting into the my spikes, friends? spikes, there's the things themselves. That's it. I can, can I can hear the sounds, but I can't can see the students. You can hear the sounds of the chanting, but you look behind you, you see nothing. They seem to be staring out. What's happening to the, um, to the dagger thing? Is there anything on the um, altar that's like that, or not dagger, I'm sorry, the spear? Is there anything, the, the is spike? it glowing? No, it's like just what? sitting there. It's just, it's just laying there. Your options are, you can try to physically like grab your oh, allies. Yeah, that's gonna work. You could attack, you can actually just, you could make an attack again. You can try to destroy one of these objects. There's, there are four objects that are just continuously attacking your, yeah, your allies. Yes, I would like, You could okay. try to destroy one of them. Okay. Um, you could try to heal, you could try to cast any of the spells that you yeah. may have. Available. I don't have like, any spells. Yeah. So, um, grab this, grab this I know, I know, I'm, I know, that's. 
Um, so, I, my, thank you. That's what I was going to do. Can I please go get the spike? Because I'm going to fight these things. Okay, you go and grab the spike. You see, I mean, this thing is huge. It's huge. Yeah, I'm stronger than I look, okay? All right, well, make a, make a strength check. It's like an iron spike, a six foot yeah. iron spike. Oh, no, no. Uh, you are not stronger than you look, Lyra. You, <laughs> you are, you are, you are not <laughs> able to budge this thing. It's like lift, it's like, and yeah. I can't you, get it. So, so you spend your time trying to lift this thing. Crack. Make it your next oh. person. Try to throw off. Come on. Whoa, my God. Eight, six you plus two. stand there. Perfect. You're not doing well. What's your AC? 20. 20? Okay. Um, the, the, the things are, are cutting it, but they actually do more damage to your armor than to you actually are. Uh, take no further damage this round. Oh, wait, I forgot with that barrier. Oh, I forgot about my barrier. Oh, yeah, it, it converts absorbs. five points of damage. Per source. Per source, yes. So so you got hit twice, so it absor have absorbed. It would have churned 10 points that you've taken so far into non-lethal damage. OK, so I was still up where I was, but I'm taking non-lethal damage, which I could potentially be un be knocked out from Yeah, I mean, yeah, you would eventually be knocked out, yes. OK. And the barrier can absorb 30. a certain amount. Okay. Yeah, 30, Great. so, so I'm down to 20. So yeah. Marcus, make a will save to try to shrug this off. Come on, someone help me here. Oh. <laughs> All right, I'm counting on you, Alex. Able. AC's Marcus, 20. AC's 20. You take seven more points of damage. It's cut and flay you alive. I am, Alex. I am bleeding really badly. Very badly. Alex, make a will save. Please. Oh, no, come on! Oh, thanks. Oh. I'm done. What's your AC? <laughs> 17. 17. You are unharmed this round. Yes. Lyra, it's your Still turn. Still trying to get the spike. 19. 19. You managed it. So basically, three, you have this thing. Three and and two. It's, I mean, it's taller yeah. than you Hold are. Hold on, 19 so plus strength. strength. Yeah. I have to have something for that. Your strength bonus. Yep. Plus one. Plus one. 12. No, okay, so, you, so you've kind of got this thing in your hands, so and, it's, and it's super heavy. Plus, what are you doing? Plus one. <coughs> what? I have it in my hands. I'm going to go fight one of the things off That's my friend. Yes, I mean, this please. thing is. He's bleeding a lot. You're basically It'll be like the dragon on the altar. Yeah, you are not going to like wield this like a staff. This is not a weapon. That's not. That's not what this is for. You just picked up a heavy thing. I just wanted to show people that I could. Um. No. Uh. You mean it really doesn't help me at all, this spiky thing? Darn it. Okay, really well, I throw that, that down, down, and I'm running to go help my friends. He's bleeding a lot. They're so. right next to you. They're, no, okay, right I'm fighting off the thing. What are you doing? Fighting off whatever's killing him. All right, so you use a standard action to pick up the thing. You drop it. Yeah. So you don't have another standard action this round. The next round, you can attempt to help your friends. Uh, Craig, uh, this is where we die. <laughs> Craig. Yeah, you said I was going to die. You Shrug fight it off. But look at me. I'm coming to your rescue. Because no, you're bleeding. You haven't done anything. Well, I'm trying. Changing I thought that here. that was going to help. I'm going to turn. And it was I'm wrong. turning my fortune around right now. Come turning, on, man. Turning his fortune Turn that brown upside down, buddy. <laughs> go, Craig, go. Please, please. Come on. Your fortune was not turned around. The things make another attack against you. Sacrifice a you. To their bloody god, you take five points of damage, which is all converted into non-lethal yes. damage. Marcus. Twenty-two. Twenty-two. The part of you that knows that this is deadly and terrible suddenly regains control. You are standing there bleeding from these wounds. Your friends are being flayed alive. You have a full round of actions to take. What are they? Five foot step back. You step down off the altar. Okay. Uh, magic missile. I have three bolts. That sounds like there's four things attacking us. Yes, four objects. One bolt at each. One bolt at, at, at each. Three Roll damage from each one. Well, I don't have a magic bolt, or that's what I would have used. Just was gonna use a spear and throw it. Clearly. One takes three. One takes four. The other one takes four. All right. You definitely damage the objects, but they are still. Sharp and ready to kill. Alex, this is your chance. This is your opportunity. 20 on the die! 20 on the die! That is my will save. You regain control oh, of yourself. 
You yes. are standing there, bleeding profusely. I got you. What do you do? I go to crush these tools. You draw your dagger and attack. Yes. Go ahead, roll and attack. That's what that she was does. good. <coughs> 10 plus my, where's my dagger? Eight. Eight. 18. That's uh, that you strike one of them. Roll. Dagger door. against dagger? Yes, One dagger against dagger. Perhaps. 1d4 plus 3. 2 plus 3, 5. 5. All right. Strike it. Slam it. Uh, Ryan Summer says, Crack, go put Jim in a headlock for God's sake. Oh. Lyra, yeah, your friends um, look like they're starting to shake this off. Yes. They're coming to. So off. I'm going to channel um, channel energy to to heal them because they're all hurting and I'm close Wait, to them. Wait, no. That is true. That is true. Oh, all right. Do you channel energy. Dennis Brisson says, Nine. Davis, I swear nine. this is me who is Make rolling these Make a caster level check for each of your friends. What? Make me a too. caster level check. No, not for you. A caster level? Caster level check. Yep. Roll your d20. Alex and one for Matt. four. Okay. I was saying, sorry. Dennis, Dennis, Dennis is Yeah, uh, Lee, what? Alex. That one was Alex. So Alex, 18. you are not healed. 18? No. Can I do it for each roll of them? For Craig. Yeah, you have to roll one for each. Two? Nope. Two. All right, so you, you, are, not healed. you are healed, but, and you are healed, but Alex Why is, and Craig oh, seem man. untouched by your healing light. <sighs> well, Dennis Brisson says, Jeebus, I swear this is me who is rolling these dice. My dice rolls are usually just like this. <laughs> Thanks Dennis. a lot, Dennis. Thanks for rolling for us, Dennis. Dennis. Uh, Make a will save, buddy. We have to do some. Oh, you're I still caught. Jesus, right? spell? Yes. Come on. Surprised Break I free. just didn't completely submit. Break free. Kalima. <sighs> oh. 19. Kalima. 21. You finally. Regain control of your senses. Smash! What do I see? Smash you see several bloody instruments of death that suddenly fall, clattering to the to the stone table, some of them off onto the steps, rolling down. They look now ancient, rusted, and useless. Let's get out of here. I detect magic on them. You detect no magic. We need to get out of here. Well, what the hell just You happened? activated that. We need Activated to get out. what? A trap in the trap Look at, tunnel. You're not Did you well. see those people? Yeah, I saw those people. What people? I didn't see any people. What people? There, there was were some people, people that are the voices. We in were the sacrifice. I didn't see them. I could not see them. The whole time. You I heard go, them, but I couldn't the see them. You can grab the if you want and see them. No, I can't. Can I really? Yeah, do it. Wait, what? Did we know that she moved the spike? Yeah, you can see that it, it's, well, right it's actually now. like if she dropped it, it would have rolled down Did you move that spike? Yeah, because I thought it was going to help, and it didn't stop anything, and it was too heavy to hit anything with, so it didn't matter. But yes, I did. And that's magical. Is it? No one told me. You guys just started going up and getting killed on your own, and I didn't know what oh, to yeah, do. Oh, yeah, because that's what I wanted to do. I'm going to look at the spike. Okay. You look at it, and it looks like it is a, it's definitely a huge, heavy iron. Um, I think solid. That, uh, it doesn't look rusted, which is surprising. Although you know that it is magical, so that's maybe not so surprising. Uh, it looks to be covered in in runes that you don't recognize, except for one. You notice that at the head of it, on, on the flat surface of the head, uh, is the symbol of woe. Is it what? The symbol of woe. Oh, I picked that up. Wah. Okay. So I point this out to them. I say, this is very clear that, Craig, you would have to hit this spike into something. Would this be... Why Craig? I could carry well, it into the dragon. to kill a dragon? Yeah. Well, I don't... Well, that's probably good to have. I have no that. idea what it's for. Do it, can, I, can I look at the dragon statue? Yeah, absolutely. Make a perception check. Nope. Uh, seven plus seven, 14. 14? Uh, yeah, I mean... You don't notice anything out of the ordinary, except that lying on the ground near the statue is a stone, a flat stone with a room etched in the surface. You pick it up, and it, you really, it actually is very familiar to you. It looks very similar oh to the stone room number stone two. that yeah. you have placed in your hammer. Room stone number two? Look at this, look at this. Room stone. You got a cool room wow. stone. Wow. Get more to four on the, on the phone. Get him on the horn. <laughs> I can't get Morty on the phone. God. That's pretty. That's awesome. Oh, look. Leave you him there. Get yourself nope. a bag. Leave him there. <laughs> You're the bad luck of holding it. Put it back. That's not true. The bad luck of holding it. I am Put. not. It saved my life. 
Uh, it saved my back. life when no. Ted put it back have on the tower. Have you gone over to the Kickstarter for Dragon Baggins? Yeah, but put it if there you so people can see it, though. You should. Actually. They're really cool. Uh, and you should get yourself one. You should support them. They're going for stretch goals now, and you can get yourself a bag for. They're uh, so cute very and fluffy. Yeah, and they are really one. awesome. They are really cute. They're so cute. They are super, super cool. Aww. And they have uh, bag Thulus too, I think. Yes, oh, really? they do. Or yeah. Is, is that Ooh. pronouncing that correctly? Yeah. <coughs> Thulu? Yeah, they're really cool. They're like octopuses. Uh, oh. Still one of the dragon. Great. All right. Well, we got to get out of here. This is Rune. it. I can't help you, you know, guys if this happens that again. I, I, is what we're trying to do These, is no, get it, it out is, of here. It is. Ancient peoples like this that give us magic users a bad name. They they make this whole intricate thing. They've got a dragon the trap, and then they're gonna have this spike with some kind of riddle or mystery. And we're gonna have to hit it into a thing, and it's gonna unleash a thing or lock a thing away. It's always so rote. It's just it's just ugh, they give us such a bad name. We're far more creative. I hate magic. Um, well, <sighs> what about these magic heels? You? What about so these that's doors? The one you don't hate. Room. Let's check out the doors carefully. Okay. Oh I'm gonna detect um, We're still in a here. trap. Uh, on the I'm still in gonna here. ask Lyra to heal me. To the left or the right? Yeah. To the right. To the it. right. To the right. Um, I'm going to try to channel energy and then do my little save for them. Eight. Whatever it's called, fortitude or whatever. Eight, Eight plus channel my channel energy. Channeling energy okay. to heal my friend too. <laughs> All right. Eight. All right. Now so I've got then, a... yeah, cast your level checks. Nope. That was for Alex. It so was a seven. And 15 plus 4, 19 now. 19 now. I want to look, look at all this crap that was trying to kill Unbelievable. Okay. Can I see what the heck these things were? Yeah, Are I mean, you, okay? you see, yeah, I mean, it's very yeah, obvious sure. to you. They, they were, see, they look like, like a little bit like mm -hmm. like torture tools, or and you see a dagger, you see like a bone saw, you see these these nasty prong pinchers. It just looks like crap. It's all you right, see. Yeah, rusted now, and now they look rusted and useless and bent, like you're surprised. <laughs> yeah. Did you? Although, mean? although, when you were up on the altar, you could see that they were like new and at like like this. It, it's like they almost transformed they after went back you into the broke past the or spell. Something. Yeah. And, okay. Yeah, Ryan Summer says Jim then summons a giant lemon and squeezes the juice into Craig's wounds. <laughs> That would That's hurt a lot because nice. you are bleeding from multiple abrasions. And I, I think That's it's actually really important we point out uh, Wayward Masquerade is in the chat, uh, yeah. the makers of Dragon nice. Bag. Oh, hey, oh, I love guys. this thing! And so, uh, me too. It's so cool. cool. They if made we me stop. see that one comment, so shall if you can bring that up for us. In our they wouldn't let me keep holding it. Wayward Masquerade says there's a plunge <laughs> level where you get both oh, a Dragon Bag and a Bag Thulu. You oh, can get both bags if you cool. just donate so that they can make the darn bags for you. It's so simple. It's so it's cute. Amazing. It's so cute. It is, um, I want you to know, <gasps> players out there, if you want your fellow players, GMs, to be addicted to something and talk about nothing else and then squeeze it and hold it and you think they're actually going to kill the inanimate object, get them a dragon it's, bag. Christmas is coming up. It's so cute. I yeah. want yeah. one for Christmas. You should know that every time Ashley grabs it and you see Diana say, put that back, don't touch that, it's because she's jealous that Ashley is holding I know. the dragon bag. Because I can't really reach it. <laughs> she doesn't like that somebody else is touching it. It's true. <laughs> she has her own dragon. It's really cute. Show them your dragon. Yeah, but it's not a dragon bag. Mm, mega She's... 20. Okay. Fine. Let's, okay. Um, I, can have for it. the door I on the right, the I rolled an bag. eight plus my 11. You detect nothing dangerous. Can I look at the door? You are. You, that's what you just did. You just. Oh, I was detecting a trap. No. That's what you do when you you look oh, at things. Oh, okay. Detect Sorry. The traps. That's what you, you are inspecting it visually. No. <laughs> you got this, Alex. But do I see anything else? It's just no, it's, it's just, just a, door. a door. You could open it. It looks like there's a way to open. There's a there's a latch. You can open it. You can so open cute. it. You open the door, and suddenly. Was it? They have a handle. Yeah, I just said it had a latch. My goodness. I don't like suddenly. I don't. I don't like those words. You guys have ruined the moment. The door opens. There's just a. There's a short <laughs> tunnel beyond. Like you guys are just the worst. Why am I even here? <laughs> Why See, are short you? tunnel beyond. No, um, just kidding. Much like the one that you came down to enter this wide chamber, there's another short tunnel. You can see that at the other side of it, there's definitely another another room that you can see. There's no door interposing. Although there's no more light down there, so you can see the like the, the dim. But you yeah. can't, like, you know that there's a room ahead, but you don't know what because you can't oh, see. Oh, so many traps. Very well. So there's. Do I see her open the door? Yeah. It's loud, I'm sure. Do you guys want to go in? 
I, I you know, yes. No, I don't want to do anything. We need to get out of this room. <laughs> we got to figure out. I don't think I'm very good at dungeoneering, but I feel like that's the wrong way. You but do? then again, right is always right is wrong, so that's what we always choose. So should we go? Should I look at the other door? Yeah. This is like Alice in Wonderland. Well, we want to open both doors. Why not? I don't know what then to do. Then we can see which dark hallway we want to go through. I'm really scared. Laura has a point. <laughs> Just make All sure right. you don't I'm going to walk to the other door. Okay. I'm going to detect trap. Look, he's, he's Leaving the other one open because hands, certainly wings. nothing. We don't close doors. I don't here. close doors. We don't you can close, close door doors. if you want. I rolled a four. You go the other door. Plus my 11, 15. You rolled a what? A 15? Four plus my 11, 15. Terrible roll. Yep. You detect no traps. There's Tobias in his shirt down there. <gasps> Tobias! Yeah. And he's here with his shirt on. In you person. want a shirt? If you want a shirt, you can go to wictheseries.com and get your own. And get one. All right, uh, the door appears safe. Should I open this door? Yes. Sure, you open this one. Then nothing came out of it, so I think we're all right. Marcus doesn't want me to, okay. I think we need to I see open the door. Out you open the door. Uh, it's a scene much like the other chamber. Uh, you see a short hallway, and then there's definitely a room beyond, but you can't really make out much. Uh, it's all dim light. Let's start that way. All right. Light it, light her up. Boop. Light me up, up, up. Yeah. Look, you you're like can, a sunbeam. You guys can stay here. We're going in. Are you, no, we're not uh, going are you to separate. Light on? Because she already has. She still has light on her. Oh, she still has light on her. Oh, okay, great. Right. Never mind. Don't need to. Um, so I, I'm going to follow them because I'm not going to oh, split up. Still. I think okay. that's silly, and I'm not staying in this room. That's All right, for sure. So I've got, I've got the three of you. Marcus, you're staying out. Marcus, come on, man. No, I'm walking behind them. Oh, you're walking behind. Okay, so everybody. <laughs> Brian Newman, a ghost must have entered Jim Jam because he's gotten more aggressive. Same thing happened to Lyra when a ghost entered her. That's true. <laughs> That's true. When Lyra was entered, things changed forever. Wow. <laughs> Here I am. All right. Yeah. All right. I am. You go down this <laughs> yeah. short hallway. And soon. <coughs> come on, dragon. Come to an ancient dusty chamber that looks like it hasn't been used in centuries. Dust swirls into the air with every step and covers a myriad of objects you see on ancient rickety shelves. But your eyes are drawn to five objects in particular. Oh, no. Five dolls sitting oh, my above God, they're a Buddha dolls bed of us. in the room. There is also a rusty footlocker near the bed. What do you do? They're Buddha dolls? Uh, we, what are they? What are they? Voodoo we, dolls? We both, do we both see this? Oh yeah, are you guys are there. Seen? Yeah. Oh. What are you seeing? <gasps> There's food and toss of us. Is it? How do you know it's of us? I detect magic. Does a, a you husband? detect some source of this? There's definitely magic in this. Can room. we move? Let's move closer. Do not touch the. Do not move closer. Stop saying that. Oh, I'm, I'm that. not touching it. I want to see what. Move closer. I love it. Who did it? You did it. I did. You did it. He okay. asked me. What are you, are you saying? No, I said, let's move. Let's move. He said, let's move closer. Move closer. Let's, that's closer. that's all he said. Like, in, we should be leaving this house. Do you what are you doing? Do you detect magic? Yeah, there's magic, Alex. We need to get out. Voodoo dolls usually have magic. And they look like us. We need to get out. How do we know? I can't tell that they look like us. Do you like see us. those things? They're terrifying. It's really you hard to see. closer and inspect them, Craig. Don't. Don't. We don't need to know. We just know that they're voodoo dolls. We need to get out of here. Wait, Daryl, don't a, mess with that a, crap. Wait, there's something under the bed. Daryl Willard <laughs> says, flip the runestone for heads or tails. <sighs> we need to not be I in like this room. I like that idea, Daryl. I'm going to flip. Uh, oh my gosh. Oh my okay. gosh. Love it. <sighs> what, to, uh, to, to do what? He OK, heads, I, I go forward and, I, I'm and with grab. You on this one. The Foot Locker. Okay. I'm stepping back. I'm Tails. With, I'm with Marcus. Tails, we go to the other room. Okay. Okay. I am with None Marcus. None of those options include the dolls. That's really disappointing. Fire, fire up the dice cam for me. Oh, man. We're going to the other room, guys. Let's go. Oh, that was so uneventful. What if? The, aww. Ah, uh, what if it was really cool and Alex, there? you could just go grab it. Go for it. No one's stopping you. Yes, you we are. Grab the foot Stop it. You're, you're a grown woman. You know what? You grab the Foot Locker. You grab the dolls. <laughs> I'm not touching the dolls. I don't even see what, I can see that there's things. I don't know what they are. What in the world? Let's, how about before we grab anything, let's go to the other room and see what's in the other room. That's what I just No, no, I know, I know, no, you're right, you're right. Yes, 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 I know. That's what I'm cool. saying. Cool. I let them all go ahead of me. I know you said that, Mr. Gray. 
I let them all go lead ahead and I follow them. All right, you turn around like wussies and go into the other room. Oh, come on, back. No one calls so me a wussy. I will go like that. Wait, like, I didn't want to deal we with this. We are afraid. <laughs> All right. There's something uh, here. Afraid, you go to the other room. I don't think I can uh, defeat them. I assume you're just them. going into yeah, it like you're just going to, into it like we did. Yes. Okay. Cool. Same order. Awesome. You enter a large chamber, rotten, with the stink of mildew and mold. Oh, in no. the center of the chamber is a pool cut into the floor. There is water, but it is covered in a thick layer of sludge that makes it impossible to see the pool's bottom. <laughs> On one wall of the chamber is a stone chute that looks choked with cobwebs and leads to some unknown depth. The nearest thing, like your your immediate like thought in looking at it is almost like a trash chute or like a refuse, mm -hmm. like something that you would discard things into. It's very small and narrow. It looks like, um, Perhaps like someone as small as, as Alex or Lyra oh, I'm not could, going down could there. get into there, but like Craig and Marcus would probably have be. No, have could it be a feeding chute? No, it definitely goes out. Like it, it's it's angled down, so it would go out of this room. It wouldn't it wouldn't bring things into this room. Mm -hmm. No, I know. I'm saying. <sighs> oh, you're you saying would you have yeah. something and you're feeding something That's, it's in? A possibility. I mean, you don't really know. Detect magic. You detect no. Magic. Okay. Is, what's what is this? Is this a toilet? This sludge? This <laughs> hole in the what middle? Is this? Who's got knowledge of engineering? Mm, I have not. I have knowledge uh, engineering. I I've got. Can I roll for that? It's gone. I can allow that. Yeah. Sixteen plus my five. Good. Is twenty-one what? knowledge of engineering. Yeah. I mean, as near as you could tell, some kind of chute for refuse. Craig mentioned something about food. It doesn't really strike you as like a feeding chute. Um, it's just more like... Uh, you don't see any like, like you would guess. I mean, and it's it's old, but you would think you would see like maybe some streaks of dried blood or something, like if they were feeding meat or something into this, but it doesn't strike you that way. Um, I don't know, guys. Is this a bathroom? Yeah. yeah, I think it's just like a waste. It's, I don't think it's a feeding. What's with this water? What's with this water? What do I know about the water? You would guess, uh, I mean, not, not much. You know, it's, it's very old and stagnant. You certainly wouldn't want to drink it. Mm. Old, is, stagnant, rotten. Is there... It's just gross, Craig. Are there any stones or anything we could throw in oh, there? Oh, yeah, there, there's plenty of, like, loose rocks and stuff. Yeah. Throw a rock in there? No! <laughs> it sort of, like, sinks down into the sludge. And oh, there's, a, there's, like, some no! rippling. The dragon's gonna be in there! Uh... This room is not like that huge. Oh, okay. <laughs> this is much smaller than the room, like the chamber that you run with the statue. Maybe it's um, a baby dragon. This, this, this sinks down. It actually almost like lands on top of the sludge and then see sinks him throw down the under stone, it. I'm like, I'm like backpedaling. All right. I don't Marcus think this back is a good out. idea. You are watching. God damn it. For just a moment as the ripples end. <laughs> Stupid. Um, and you're studying it's it. Like all I hate you and your dumb quickly. barbarian. I throw a thing. Ugh. And then you see this layer of slime begin to shift and bulge in several places. Not oh. just where you threw the stone, but all around the pool. Oh, uh, guys, back up. Let's go. Dark yeah, I back up. Rise I back up. Back out. out I back up. The sludge, I'm getting out. Get... Bloated corpses, no. No, dripping have... water, no. and rotted no. bits of flesh. No, we're, we're oh, no. I already have money rot. And you see their seething hatred and hunger. But it's again, no, our back, yeah. You guys backpedal out of the room as these corpses are like rising up out of the water. Close the door. Backing away. Yeah. Run. Slam the door. Yes. Yeah. Latch. There's no latch. And we you run. Know, you said there was a latch. Run right out of the room. We're going through the other tunnel. I go grab the, grab the iron spike and Get drop it. the door. Yeah. All right. You grab the iron spike. Wait, yeah. hold on. As I, as I told him to run and go yeah. grab it, I'm thinking to myself, were those like apparitions? No, you saw, I mean, what you saw was, corpse was, was with, these, was, these. They were actual corpse. Yeah, they were yeah. manifestation. Okay. Yes. Okay, yeah, yeah, grab the spike. <laughs> I grab spike, the spike. Spike, spike, it in. Okay. Can we, you, uh, can I somehow block the door? I mean, yeah, it, it's, even for you, it's like heavy and heavy. You gotta like almost drag it across. Wow, I did good. Um, oh gosh, we can But help. you lay it, in, I mean, basically it's so heavy, you just, lay, you can lay it there. You could try to hammer it into the stone if you wanted, <sighs> but. Or you just want to lay it there. Let's run. It we need to run. Why is no one listening to me? Yeah, is, there, is it possible run? to try to hammer it? Yeah. Down a little that's, bit into the stone in front of the door. I'm trying it. All right, no, 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 don't, no, don't hammer. No hammering? It's a symbol of woe. We don't know what's going to happen. No, we need to get just, out of here. Nah. Don't even do that. I set it down in front of the door. All right, you set it everyone, down. Because everyone, are a bunch of babies. Locking it. We need to, I don't know I'm what, a baby. Let's get that lockbox. Yeah? 
and get the hell out of here. Are you kidding me? Why are we not wait, leaving? Wait, do we hear anything? Like, does it sound like we make a perception check? I'm back stepping from the door. Nine. Why? 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 Plus nine. Eighteen. 11 plus 7, I'm just 18. hearing if they're coming okay. towards the door. Uh, you guys are standing there, listening, listening. Yeah. A minute passes, two minutes. Everything aside from your companions who are constantly like, guys, we need to go need to now. Go. But you hear nothing no coming from the other listening. side of the door. Okay, well, maybe we're safe from that. Just because sure, they're strong does not mean we're not that we aren't but strong we could also. Be, we you could be get, you safe You want to get that lockbox? Look at these little figurines. Oh, what if they're oh us? And there's yeah, a way to sacrifice for us. Yes. I'm going to stress well, eat. Would you like one? I'm in that cup. If, okay. If we saw the woe symbol on the spike, this is dedicated to woe. The people who worship woe trap the dragon here. We are the we are the chosen ones. We are the disciples. So right. of course they would be us. Right. But you said there were five? Yes, there were five. Five what? Five figurines. Dolls. Yes. Five dolls. There are five dolls. There's only four of us right now. Well, there's only four of us right now, but remember in the prophecy, they thought there was only four. Yeah, that was but weird. But then there was a fifth. So. <sighs> I don't understand why they would know there was a fifth. Well, remember there, there was a fifth. The, yeah, there but I thought the original prophecy. Said four. Said four, and then the fifth priest was the one that thought there was five. Right? The way that you remember it was that the uh, the prophecy was fe- was uh, sealed by the four priests, and there were supposed to be four champions. And then the fifth priest had actually been banished or betrayed that. or something and, and sealed away. Prophecy. And it was said that he altered the prophecy somehow, perhaps bringing a fifth into it for some other purpose, I am. not yep. sealed to the original prophecy. John Kazier, we, we just missed his comment, but I think he was saying, always disturb an ancient body of water. <laughs> That's just it's Adventuring 101. That's just Adventuring 101. Yeah, you just do that. And Wayward Masquerade, of course, makers of Dragon Bag. Could those dolls be linked to the corpses? How many corpses are there? Uh, um, we got out of there More before. than enough. Yeah. Okay, yeah, we can put it back up. Oh, yeah. Yeah, put a little sleep? dice in there. He's gonna, gonna, gonna sleep, sleep because I want people to see him. He's so cute, what I don't guys. Like, He's so cute. Oh. What I really, really, really don't like is everything around you. <laughs> is that I don't want to fulfill some dumb prophecy. <laughs> but in order to get out of this thing, We're we have to fulfill have a part of the prophecy. to go look at the dumb. We have to hit the dumb spike at some point. We need to go look at the dolls. So, you know, yeah, let's go look at the dolls, sure. Whatever, you guys go look at them. Lear and I will stay here. Yeah. Hey, at least there's no chanting anymore. Yeah. Right? No chance. This is an untrapped hallway. No, I, no, no chanting, I said. No chanting. Chanting, chanting, chanting was... Fun. Chanting's over. It was nerve-wracking. Okay. Are you guys going to come with us? No. We're going to stand at the to. door. No, no. That's you, fine. Oh, they're going to stand at the door? We'll let That's you know fine. if the things come out. Okay. So let's go in there. So let's go examine. We're going let's back in the room the with the lockbox. Yeah. Okay. You go back in the room with the lockbox. You see that the, the, the footlocker is under the, under the bed. Does it have a handle or anything? Yeah, or? yeah, you could you could just grab it. Yeah. Well, let me detect. Could we get it somehow with a grappling hook or somehow be away and? Try oh yeah, to... sure. If you're a giant baby, you could absolutely. Yeah, a ten foot pole. Yeah. I uh, think Quigley has your ten foot pole. Ten foot pole, my rope net sack. Do you guys have rope? Oh my god. Or does Quigley have I all have, your rope. rope. No, I have rope. We all have. Yeah. yeah all have rope. I don't got any rope. I have uh, rope. You really? You don't want to just grab it? Right. You don't want to go in there, Craig? He yeah, called you a baby. He just wants to do something stupid with those dolls. He wants us to... <sighs> I just want what's best for you. I want you to get what you want out of this. I'm just saying, like, here's, here are your options. You just go in there. How it. well, so with the light of the dagger, Yeah. how well can we see? You can see pretty well. I mean, like, with the light of the dagger, you can that gives you full oh, light. Oh, shoot. So can we? I go running down into there. OK. After them. Why? So don't touch the dolls. We're just looking at them. No, 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 no. don't touch them. Can can we get to Don't touch them. No, if so, I'm fulfilling a stupid part of a prophecy, it is not going to involve me. So we're going to go as an avatar. Look. We're going forward yes. together. Okay. We're holding hands. Begin creeping forward. Do holding not, hands. Creeping forward. We're holding hands. holding hands. Do not touch those dolls. We're just Why? looking. Right we're just here. looking. You looking at the you want to look at the dolls? We're looking yes. at the dolls but from a distance. We're not getting close. Well, I mean, your light is only from 20 a distance. feet, so I mean, you got to Well, fine. 
Brent? We're, we're getting we're close enough to... We're 10 to feet closer. There are five dolls sitting in a row. One of that which is holds so a creepy. large hammer. Another is, is dressed in black holding a knife with long braid. That's me. Uh, another has a... A dunce cap. <laughs> a dunce cap. Uh, that is true. Another has a dunce cap. Um, one of them has long blonde hair. Uh, it's not me. And another one has a, a oh it looks like a book in its hand. Oh my gosh. Oh god. Okay. Um, what creeper would make those? It looks like yeah. they've been here for a long time. I know, I'm saying that off book. Okay, here we go. Because I'm looking at them box. right now. Okay. Bend down, grabbing the lockbox, dragging it from under the bed. Some stuff rattles around inside. And then Nothing it bites them. Nothing happens? So, I have learned things in real life. <laughs> so that whole buco thing. What buco yeah. thing? When we were filming Walking in Circles season one, uh, there was a camp, there was one of the picnic grounds, and we, were, we made camp there. And there was a doll. No. Very similar to that. Are you serious? Well, it was one, one of those. There was one of those things yeah. you could buy. Yeah. Little voodoo, the the with the big you know, head and the yard thing. Stuff. Oh, I had it a keychain. Yeah. Yeah, we named it with a candle. There was some sort of like sacrificial candle that it was holding. And we went up there and looked at it, and we're like, no, we're not touching this. Don't disturb that. Don't touch and, that. And yeah, Buco just like <laughs> grabs it and throws it. Did anything uh, happen? Gaul, wasn't it? Or Gaul? Gaul. Yeah, Gaul. Yeah, yeah, that's right. It was Gaul. Yeah, he he invited that evil directly into his life. Yes. Not touching those dolls. Uh, we're Don't okay. We got the box. I see. So you got the those box. Those dolls are definitely us, guys. You're dragging the box Great. away. That's you notice good. one of the dolls at the end. It sort of like teeters, falls down onto the bed. Oh. As you're moving. Grab the box. This is Drag terrifying. It out of the room. Wait, which doll fell? Was it me or was it Alex? You, you can't really see. I mean, the lights so dim. Do I see? Which doll Here, fell? Here, are you in the room? Are you in the room? I'm not. I am not in the room. I. Lyra. Not. All right, so I, I come running because I thought I up. hear them that they're, they're like they're like dragging this box out. Of why the did you they touch the back. doll? You didn't put this on. Look back. Something fell. What's on the bed? Why did you touch the doll? And what? Look at the bed. There's, right. a doll. There's just a doll lying on the bed. You yeah, can't really tell. Which distance, doll? It's, you can't really tell. Why can't they tell? Because it's just it's just a little doll. Fine, so I get closer. Like, okay, how close? Not that close. Like really close? <laughs> Not that close. That's ridiculous. I'm not gonna oh, you do wanna, that. Because it's laying face down, you can't really tell. But if it had. Look at the hair. Oh, for fuck's sake! Well, I go to the freaking bed and I look at the freaking doll. You see a doll oh, with Jesus. a long braid. That's me. Lying on the bed. Great. Oh, that is scary. You didn't touch it though, right? She had to flip it over. She did. She I did. have a little heart Maybe on my we chest. Should. Oh, that's she had to good. flip it over. Maybe we should take the doll so that no one can hurt us. If we take the dolls, no one can hurt us. If they keep the dolls, they can't. They can hit us. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! I just saw something! Maybe the reason that you guys were all being like attacked with those things that were in the air, just stabbing you and such, were because they were doing it through this other room. Maybe that's what that was, where they nope. were stabbing the dolls. Nope. Why do you say no to now, me? Now, the only thing that Craig thinks in his head is that her doll fell off the shelf. Oh, no. Could that mean that she is going to die? That's what I. That's think. what I'm thinking. Definitely. Yeah, definitely. Great. <laughs> Do I feel doll, any different? No, you don't feel any different. I mean, you feel a little shaky, but that's just you've been feeling that way since <sighs> since you fought the. Take the freaking tree. dolls. Let's get, let's get out, out of here. No, we're not. Take, don't touch that doll. Why? Are you sure? If we take the dolls, someone can hurt us. Wayward Masquerade says Schrodinger's Dungeoneering Pack. You don't know if you have rope or not until you reach in. <laughs> um. <laughs> Look, <laughs> at this point, at this we point, it's them. all guesses. If we don't take the dolls, then someone can hurt one you. Way you go, one way could go Lyra's way. The other, the other way, the, the way my mindset was, if we touch the dolls, Whoa. then we activate the thing, whatever the thing yeah, is. Yeah. Uh, Marcus, do you, do you, did you detect earlier magic on the dolls? Oh, yeah, they're yeah. magical. Oh, God. How powerful of magic did I detect on them, Jim? Well, you hadn't taken the time to, because the, the way where you can detect an aura, and then if you spend a minute, you can focus to detect how strong. Oh, I'll go back and spend a minute. Yeah, spend a minute. Uh, actually, now that you're, you don't detect any more magical magic in the room. We need to get 
the heck out. Should we grab the dolls? We should grab the dolls. Where are you going? I'm gonna go punch Jim in the face. Why? <laughs> you have your mic right, on. Well, on. While you're gone, I think we should grab the dolls. Wait, let me ask Dude. Marcus, did you detect magic? I hate dolls. so much. Oh, so I'm doing is weaving a wonderful Marcus, tale. Marcus, did you detect magic on the dolls? Find enjoyment Rich for everybody. Richard Sloan, orcs, no problem. Dolls, run away. <laughs> you so, don't well, understand. Goblins and dolls. My initial, my initial expectations are correct. You touched the doll on the bed, didn't you, Alex, to turn it over? I didn't touch any doll. No, she didn't touch the doll. It she fell on its own. You said she touched, it she touched it to flip it over, right? I mean, she's, I mean, she doesn't have to have touched she it. She came over that's and saw the hair. you specifically wanted to avoid doing. That's fine. Yeah, no, I just, I literally said, like, the I doll. just got frustrated. After, I wanted to look at the bed to yeah. see what, who fell on the bed. Okay, let's back up. Did I detect magic on the dolls ahead of time? You, I thought you said I did, but maybe you, you were you just You detected inferring. magic. I said there's, you detect magic in the room. Now okay. you're not detecting I magic. I detect magic on the footlocker. Okay, yes, yeah, so you detect an aura of magic coming from the footlocker. Okay. Oh. Oh right. my goodness. What's gracious. happening? There's magic in the foot locker or the foot locker's magic. Okay, so, but there's no magic Magical on Magical foot locker? Can we get Air Jordans? <laughs> How about the dolls? Wow. Should we just take the dolls if I, I don't think Why are we taking the dolls? Because I don't want anyone to stab me in a different place and I feel something that's killing me, but I'm not where my doll is. You should tell that to your therapist. No, I'm Whoa. talking about our freaking dolls. Down here. <laughs> I want you guys like... to know that I know that I there hasn't know. been a lot of action and excitement, but this is a great episode because these four people before me are terrified, Gosh. and they have been terrified for the last oh, yeah. two <laughs> hours straight. Just constant terror, constant anxiety. They are- I am nervous. Very, very shaken. I let's don't... look in the footlocker. Let's bring the footlocker out into the bigger room and open it. Oh my gosh, I'd feel a lot better if I had spells in these glasses. Do not stand on okay. those. Here it goes, here it goes, here it goes. Let's go. Here. Check it for a trap before you I will. No, I will. I will. I will. I'm just afraid of leaving these dolls alone. I think the dolls. These are not hers anymore. Nope. All right, let's go to the main room. Okay, drag everything out to the main room. Yeah. All right. Okay. I'm dragging it. Dragging it. Sarah McNeil thinks we should take the dolls. Yeah, I see you looking at me like, hey, this is dragon. Yeah, I know. Dragon. Brian Sumner's shaking his head right now. No, everybody's shaking their head. Everyone's shaking their head. Everybody's shaking their head. Well, especially that, that smile. Sarah McNeil them. wanted us to take the dolls. Which, it's better to exactly have them. what I said, Sarah. But no one's listening to me. We and you are, did. We are a strong, independent woman. If you want those Fine. dolls, go in and get them. I'm grabbing my doll. Okay. I guess. As you guys are moving out, you see Lyra like stomps off. What are you doing? Comes back a minute later. With the doll. With the I doll just in her hand. yours. You guys didn't want yours. I was contemplating it. <laughs> contemplating? I'm taking my dog because I don't want anyone to stab me where there's Do you hear else. this music? Yeah, but there, it's not chanting anymore because that was what you decided yeah, to do. Should we just go grab our dolls? You should go freaking you grab your dolls. Grab your doll. Dylan Kaiser says, ah, the magical footlocker contains an extra dimensional space where Mortifor has been hiding out this entire time. Oh open it gosh. up and get him, guys. It'd be so funny. Get your doll, let's open this thing up. Oh my gosh. Should we get all the dolls? <laughs> you do, you the sure. the traps. On the Never mind. Locker. I sit on the floor and I detect traps on the locker. Right, all. I'm gonna write that. Twelve in. plus my eleven. You detect no traps. No trap. Wait. Could there be a magical trap? Yep. Can you detect Can a magical you detect trap? That? I detect what type of magic it is, Jim. Um, you focus for a bit. You you feel that there are several different. You you are detecting auras from a couple <laughs> different schools. <clears throat> Schools. <coughs> well, do I? I have no idea. Try and I'm open not it. versed in traps. Ugh, I go back and I grab you know all the voodoo dolls because do I not know. Touch my doll. I already did. Okay. Obviously, we're here for a reason. Because I don't want to have I'm to. Open it up. Oh, hey, I'm open. with you, Lyra. You don't want to have to deal with this later. You just grab I don't want to deal with that. Grab all I've the dolls. got all the dolls. I think it's a great idea. I'm just going to open it. Which Personally. that does not make She's me feel good. She's collecting them all. I got all the dolls. She's got all the dolls. All the dolls. Yeah, open it. Are you gonna make them play? No, I'm not. I just don't want anyone to I'm mess with my friends. The if I can help it, I don't locker. know if that's gonna help. But oh, you're disabling what? Ribbon in its hair. The mm -hmm. a ribbon the box. In mm -hmm. How beautiful. Or I can well, just open it up. Someone said that that you're trying to open that it up. That could yes. be Marcus because okay, Marcus yeah. doesn't have you, a hat. You can open it. So I'm going to Aww. open it. The lid creaks open. Dust puffing out. <laughs> You look inside, Ants. and you see nothing. Something that we will talk about in a few minutes. Oh, 
no! after a break. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching that part of Dragons and Stuff. I hope that you will check out more parts of the adventure and that you will join us live Fridays, 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time at facebook.com slash dragonsandstuff. We'll see you then.